Hi there. I want to talk about a very important subject that all of us need to know. Do you need peace? Many people lose their peace because they've been hurt by a loved one or injured by someone or some disaster or some sickness. And the word of God says, great peace of those that love thy law. And he keeps him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on him. And we do need to learn forgiveness, but that doesn't mean that we necessarily forget the hurts. So we need God's peace. So do you need peace? I have some scriptures for you here. You will experience God's peace, which is far more wonderful than the human mind can understand. His peace will keep your thoughts and your hearts quiet at rest as you trust in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4 and verse 7. Important verse. This righteousness will bring peace. Yes, it will bring quietness and confidence forever. Isaiah 32 verse 17. He speaks peace to his faithful people. Psalm 85 and verse 8. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. John 14, 27. The words of Jesus to his disciples. And that means us too. Come to me, all who labour and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Matthew 11, Verse 28, the Lord will give strength to his people. The Lord will bless his people with peace. Psalm 29 and verse 11. Are you getting it? For God gave us a spirit not of fear, but of power and love and self-control. Some version says a sound mind, a good mind. 2 Timothy 1 and verse 7. Those who love your instructions have great peace and do not stumble. Psalm 119 and verse 165. I'm sure King David learned that one. He will keep in perfect peace all those who trust in him, whose thoughts turn often to the Lord. Isaiah 26, verse 3. Try to keep your thoughts on the Lord. Uh, so Isaiah 26, and verse 3, that is. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Psalm 23 and verse 6. You will have courage because you will have hope. You will take your time and rest in safety. You will lie down unafraid. And many will look to you for help. Job 11 verse 18 to 19. He will shield you with his wings. They will shelter you. His faithful promises are your armour. Psalm 91 and verse 4. Why did Job have peace? He prayed for his friends who treated him badly. We need to pray for others. No evil shall be allowed to befall you. No plague come near your tent. Psalm 91 and verse 10. Don't be afraid for I am with you. Isaiah 43 and verse 5. If you lie down you will not be afraid. When you lie down your sleep will be sweet. Proverbs 3 and verse 24. True godliness with contentment is itself great wealth, or some scriptures say great gain. That can not just be material wealth, but spiritual wealth, emotional wealth, emotional health, 
That's 1 Timothy 6 and verse 6. That's my amplified version. <laughs> Your faith has saved you. Go in peace. Luke 7 verse 50. So faith brings peace. Now may the Lord of peace himself give you peace at all times in every way. 2 Thessalonians 3 and verse 16. Don't love money. Be satisfied with what you have. For God has said, I will never fail you. I will never abandon you. Hebrews 13 and verse 5. Hope those verses help you. Be blessed.